How can we use AI models like Dolly to generate textures, which might come in handy for the 2D or 3D animation process? If you don't know what Dolly is, Dolly is an image generation model from a company called OpenAI. You use it by entering text known as a prompt and getting back images. It's really that simple. In a previous video, we looked at generating assets which could be helpful for the motion graphic design process. In this video, we'll be generating texture assets and seeing how much Dolly could help us with this. Today, I'm going to be sharing what I found out. I started with a classic texture that people might look for, in this case for bricks. I made them purple just to add a very Dolly twist to it. You'll notice for some reason Dolly has even put it into a grid of four, so it's giving us four different options, in this case nine different options to choose from. As you all know, the floor is made of lava, so I've given you a few different options here for lava textures that you could use for your next project. I thought I'd switch to something liquid, something refreshing. Now, I'm not sure if you could use all of these textures because they include the bubbles at the top, but I still think they're very interesting, photorealistic ones for sure. These cardboard box ones may require some editing, some cropping or something else because they do include other parts outside of the core texture. However, they're still pretty good and I, I think they could be helpful in the creative process. Next, we'll be looking at the penny. Now, I don't know if you could use these as a texture because they have the emblem built in. However, I included them in this video because of the level of detail and the feasibility of all of these texture assets. Maybe they could be edited in Photoshop with the clone stamp tool or something. I still think they could be helpful. Next, along the lines of 3D animation, 2D animation, game development, maybe film. Uh, let's get some sci-fi floors, the texture for those. Uh, I like all of these. I like the color scheme used. I like the level of detail. And I like just sort of the theme of all of them. They're quite fitting. Here's another fun sci-fi one for you. This is the sci-fi hose texture pack. A few different options here we could use for the background. Maybe the primary object is the hose. It's really exciting. Next, this is a very classic texture you might need just simply for sand. And you see how it's given us a few different options, maybe with different lighting conditions, different parts of the world. I love the detail of these. They all seem very handy. I would use these right away. I've noticed a lot of 3D artists create things by reference, especially by looking up different surface imperfections. I wondered if Dolly could do that too. And over here, I've generated a stapler with all of its different surface imperfections. This could help and be very handy in the creation by reference for 3D assets. We've got the motorcycle helmet here. Notice all the details Dolly is including. This could help enhance the quality and photorealism of your 3D assets in the future. If you're interested in the original high full resolution images which Dolly generated, which were used in this video, I'm going to be posting them on my Twitter account. Thank you so much for tuning in. Make sure you like this video and are subscribed for more upcoming videos on Dolly 2.